Subsistence farmers in the Zambezi region have been struggling to market their livestock since the closure of the upper tour about five years ago. With the opening of the upper tour by Zamco, an organization owned by local farmers, the region's economy is about to take off as farmers are expected to reduce their herds considering the current dry climate conditions. Executive Director in the Ministry of Agriculture, Water and Land Reform, Percy Masika says the reopening will not only improve the living conditions of the farmers, but also create much needed jobs. This abattoir that was closed five years ago, rendering the farmers in this region who have livestock, having no access to markets to market their livestock, is being opened today, first time for the slot of the first cattle that are headed for the market. With the assistance of Midbot, remember the Zambezi region has plus minus 180,000 head of cattle. And for five years, if people are not marketing, it means you have extensive heavy losses. Meanwhile, the chairperson of Zamco, Robert Mapensi, encouraged farmers to market their livestock in order to boost the region's economy. Animals need to be vaccinated as per programs of the Directorate of Veterinary Services. Animals also need to be ear targeted. And before you take your animals to the quarantine, you must meet all these standards that are dictated by the DBS. About 30 people, including those who lost their livestock when it closed down, have already been employed at the abattoir, while fresh meat products would be readily available for customers. The abattoir has the capacity to slaughter 1,320 cattle per month. Reporting for NBC News, Shamin Sneva, Katima Mululo.